The bow is one of the most versatile weapons in Rust. Cheap and easy to craft, but devastating the right hands. In this video, I'll show you how to become a bow master. Today, we're going to cover the jump shot and running shot. Let's get into it. The key to both the jump shot and the running shot is learning the sound trigger. And it's part of the bow drawback animation. I'm going to do my best to explain it here and show examples. I'm going to break the draw animation into two parts. There is a lift and load portion and then a draw portion. And the draw portion of the bow is our trigger. I'm going to play the bow animation a few times here and try and pay attention to the sound. Listen to the difference of the lift and then the draw because we want that exact moment that the draw begins to be our trigger point. At this point, if you're able to distinguish between the lift and the draw sound key animation, then you're ready to move on to the jump shot and the running shot. So I'm going to give you guys a quick and dirty explanation, and then we'll go into further depth. All you have to do is to jump exactly at that trigger point, and then shoot at the end of the draw animation. Here it is in slow motion. There is a little bit of a tolerance between each different part in this jump shot, but after some time, you'll learn these tolerances and you'll have it in no time. The running shot is a little more complicated, but with a little bit of practice, you won't have a problem. The trick here is to run, right click, lifting your arrow, and as soon as you hit that draw animation, you're going to let go of the right click and sprint again. And then right near the end of the draw animation, you're going to right click again and then fire. Here it is in slow motion. Take the time to wrap your head around the concepts here, and with a little bit of practice, you'll get it, I promise. Don't be afraid to rewind and use the YouTube speed replay button to help further understand these concepts. I hope this helped you guys. If uh, you don't mind, hit that like button, drop me a comment, and ask some questions. And of course, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks. Later.